It's on Walter White. That's why the, the Breaking Bad record is on. It's on Walter White. First time I saw that this said on the disc, or on the, on the, on the record, on the front, printed on Walter White, I was a bit confused. And then, then I got it. Because it's white vinyl and Walter White. Yeah, that's that, that's that great joke. But yesterday I finally felt like a proper adult. Look at my calendar, it's a dog calendar. This is a dachshund, a long-haired dachshund. That doesn't make any sense to why I'm talking about yesterday I felt like an adult. Yesterday I felt like an adult because I, bought a, I finally bought a record player um, and speakers and stuff for it. It may not be the best setup, but for me right now it's really, really good and this year I felt more like I'm growing up more. Got a record player, got a PS4. Just buying things, Luke. Why does that make you feel growing up? It's because I can finally buy things. It's great. So, uh, let's just talk about Breaking Bad. This soundtrack is amazing. Uh, I've been listening to this. Um, that's a beautiful thing about this. And this, this vinyl is, is great. And then I was just listening to this, the Godzilla uh, soundtrack. This is a red vinyl. It's an awesome vinyl gate folder. Yeah, and I have a limit. This is a limited edition, and I've got. 820, doesn't say of how many, but that's what I've got and I love this film, so that sounds great. And uh, just, just reliving my teen years, I picked up uh, Klaxons, Atlantis to Interzone, Remixes, yeah, Remixes. This is actually full of bangers. It's like a, there's a normal record in here, just that, and then, didn't even show that properly, it's just that, the, the big record, and then, um, the little one, which is, uh, which if it wants to come out, is red as well. So uh, that's great. That's 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 really really great. That I found this at the end of my road for four pound. And listen to this, and it's actually really really good. Living my, t I think when Claxons, when this album came out with a Lance and Sonar on it, I think I was fourteen at the time. It was two thousand seven. Um, but yeah, this is actually oh that little one always. Oops, that's falling out. This is really good. Uh, let's let's get on to other things. So that's why I'm, I felt like an adult because I bought a record player and this is a really weird setup from a video today. Just my calendar in the corner. Let's spin around. That is wonky. Really, really, really wonky. So what was I going to talk about today? Today, um, while at work, um, I was on my break, walking down the street. Started hearing these uh, two Japanese people singing on the street. See them. Uh, one's got an X on his hand, and I was like, oh, is that, is that straight edge X? Uh, yeah, I was right. Um, Habari. Um, I'll quickly show them on the screen, quickly a clip. <laughs> My ca camera is really, really glitchy, so you can't even hear properly. Um, Habari, they are um, straight edge, Japanese straight edge, they're a duo. Uh, I think it's Mabari. Yeah, Mabari is a duo active in Tokyo, Japan. Music of Habari consists of tone like the old electronic game music, song and rap. Habari is selling a CD with 10 songs, several kinds of t-shirt. By all means, please check Facebook in, in Habari. Um, they paid London the other day, but I only found out about them today. Um, Facebook page and everything. I'll put, I'll put the link in the description. But um, they were fun. It was fun. I, I was on a break. I watched them perform quite a few songs. Um, but I can't find any music online, it's really weird, the website's like Japanese and stuff, so I can't find anything. I found the Facebook, but I can't find where to get that CD from, so, uh, yeah, I got to, got to watch them, and that was, that was fun. What am I here to even talk about today? I went to a dog show the other day, here's a clip. <laughs> oh, my camera's really glitchy, I think it's great that it glitched when the dog was jumping into the water. It was a dog show in Brentwood where people actually just bring their dogs along, it's not like all these people training them for ages. You bring their dogs along. Uh, there's like Scruffiest Dog, uh, Waggiest Tail, all these things, Rescue, there's like Best Rescue, which is where there's people went around, told their stories and stuff, and uh, the judge picked three winners. There was a blind dog who was massive, uh, there's a picture here, um, very, very cute. Going to dog show was cute, it was just lovely, saw lots and lots of dogs, saw Bulldogs, my, one of my favourite dogs, and got to straight Bulldogs in it. It was fun, it was a fun day, and that was um, what mum did for, for me for my birthday. Birthday's on Saturday, gonna get a video of me talking about what I do and stuff, so... That will be uh, that will be enjoyable. That will be good. That'll be enjoyable. I honestly don't know what I came here to talk about today. I've watched a hundred films this year. Ooh. That's good. Yeah, that's uh, Hot Girl Moaning is no longer the most viewed video on my channel. Um, the Cops of Anna Fritz is now the most viewed video. So 
yay, the video that was my most viewed is no longer my most viewed, and now a review is my most viewed, so it's alright, it's still good. This is just babble time. Oh, you're so interesting, Luke. You gave us a, a vlog talking about that you went to a dog show and saw some people perform music on the street and then you got a record player. You're so original, you're so creative. <laughs> that's... That's my little update. This is pretty much a video just to tell you guys, show you guys, show off that I got a record player and I feel more growing up when I buy things. Last year I bought a 40 inch TV finally. This year I got a PS4 and I got a record player. My job's brilliant and I can get things like this, so I'm so glad I'm not working at Morrison's anymore. But everyone that's working in a supermarket and retail in any shitty job, you're doing well. Keep doing what you're doing and just try and do the thing that you love the most. And uh, I know you can't always, but shut up. Who would take advice from me? That's all for today. Thank you very much. See you again very, very soon. Goodbye.